Oh, fuck, it's bright. Ooh, what up? <laughs> Currently in a baseball field, bitch. Before a storm. The drama! The invigoration! So I went on a little walk today, bitch. A little stroll in the park. Brought my fucking psychic intelligence book by the Psychic Twins. Yes, bitch, that's right! It's poignant. You know, I went under a bridge, like Rumpelstiltskin. That was cool. And now, bitch, I'm walking home, you know, it's about to rain. What do I see? The baseball field, bitch. The fence. It's open. <laughs> so I mosey on into the baseball field, bitch. There's a feeling here, I gotta say. There's a fucking feeling. First of all, jocks come here. I've never been a friend of jocks, I'm not gonna lie. Those were the turds that called me a freak. Fucking high school, because I wore neon converse. That's, that's very tame, jocks. That's a very tame look. Me and, me and the jocks in school, we had a little war going on, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I have preconceived notions about them. Maybe I think they're douchebags. Maybe sometimes I judge them and think they're an automatic douche. That's not fair. That's not fair. It's just like how they might look at me and automatically think I'm lesbian. Is it true? Yeah. But I've sucked dicks in my day. I've sucked dicks. I come into the baseball field, bitch. There's a vibe here, cunt. There's a vibe. It's a place where jocks come. It's a place of competition. It's a place of, it's a place of victory. It's a place of loss. It's a place of emotion, man. It's a place of joy, man. It's a place of, it's a place of yelling. It's a, it's, it's a, it's a place of energy. I can, I, I, I can feel the energy, bitch. I can feel it in this grass. I feel it in the wind. So I came in here, man. You know what song I put on? I'm a little ashamed about it. It's not a cool song. I put on Let Go. From the fucking Garden State soundtrack, bitch, fucking Fru Fru, bitch. I start feeling it, man. I get onto the, I get onto the grass of the baseball field, bitch, and I, I'm blasting fucking Fru Fru, cunt, and like, feeling it, man. I'm feeling it. I kick off my shoes, bitch. I don't know where they are. They're not on my feet. I start spinning around, bitch. Fru Fru blasting. Leave your feet behind, go to go out without you. It's all amazing here. Oh, you get it. Anyways, I start spinning around like the free motherfucking bitch I am. I'm spinning. I'm spinning. I'm spinning. I, I get so dizzy, I get fucked up. I, I can't. I can't. I, I can't tell where I am. Fru Fru's blasting. It was like. It was like. It was like that dope ass keg party in Riverdale, man. You know what I mean? Like. I was Veronica doing her hip-hop dance routine at the kegger on a Friday night at Archie's house, bitch. I'm making out with Archie in the closet, bitch. I'm Betty when she puts the slutty outfit on with the black wig, man. I was fucked up. I was free. I was lost. In the moment, bitch! Do you know how priceless that is? Do you know how priceless and rare that is to be in the current moment? To, to, to not be thinking about the past or worrying about the future or being, or being sad about something that might happen or thinking about something that bad thing that might happen or, or, or even, even hoping for good things to happen or, 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 or having positive projections of good things you want to come or, or wishing or dreaming. And I think that's really good. I think that's positive because I think like the psychic twins say, bitch, thoughts are real, man. Thoughts, thoughts, thoughts have energy. Thoughts have physical weight. You're creating your reality, man. Oh, fuck. I, honestly, I think I'm fucked up. <clears throat> fuck it. Even though some of those things are a good thing, we're always so caught up in what's not real. The past, that's over, man. It's not real. The future? It hasn't happened yet, man! But it's so fucking rare to click and realize, what the fuck, fuck, man, fuck! I'm here. I'm in this moment, bitch. It's fucking fleeting, but it's so dope. Because in that moment, you realize that everything else that our minds are so fucking obsessed with, all the fear, the pain, it's nothing. The realest thing is this moment, bitch. Is the moment you're in fucking right now. Me. In this baseball field. I'm touching grass right now. I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. I don't know if I understand what I'm saying. What I'm saying is. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh fuck. The rain has come. We gotta hide under the bleachers. We gotta hide under the bleachers. Like, oh, let's, let's go, bitch. Let's go. Anyways, bitch. I, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Let's be honest. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. I've been reading too much Psychic Twins book, obviously. Came to a fucking baseball field. Span around in a circle. And got fucked up. I got fucked up. But just because I got fucked up, got a little weird, got a little trippy, doesn't make it any less real. 
I felt that, man. I felt that moment. I created a fucking moment. Spinning around in a circle in a fucking baseball field. My shoes kicked off like a free fucking bitch. And just because my logical mind looks back on that now and says, Amelia, you're getting weird. You're having a weird time. Doesn't make it any less real, man. Do I live a somewhat delusional life? Maybe. Maybe I do. But if you gotta get weird, and you gotta get trippy, and you gotta get a little delusional to create some fucking genuine joy, then do whatever. Do it. Then do it. Whether it's licking Cheeto dust off your fingers. Lick those fingers. Or it's watching some shitty Aziz Ansari stand-up special. Not for me. Makes me cringe. Throw up in my mouth. But if that's your jam, man, jam it out. If it's crying in the shower, cry, bitch, no one can tell. If it's putting on mint eyeshadow to your eyebrows and screaming under the bleachers, like again, rumple stilt skin. Rumple it up. Become the silt skin. I don't know, man. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm talking about. What do I know? Is that I came to a place where jocks reside. I felt their jock vibes. Those vibes overtook me. I span around until I got nauseous. And I had a moment, man. I created a moment. This is all to say. I created a moment. And I was in the moment, bitch. And that felt dope. Dude, peep this moss under the bleachers, though. That is undeniably fucking beautiful. I am haunted. I am forever changed. Fuck you, Moss. You fucked me up. I'm not lying. The Moss is fucking me up. The Moss is fucking me up. It's really beautiful. <sighs> am I stable at this point if Moss is making me cry? Yes. You know why? Because that feels good. I want to cry about the Moss, bitch. It is fucking beautiful. It's a metaphor. It's a metaphor, man. Life and beauty and joy can grow even where Rumpelstiltskin lives, man. From the darkest shadows, beauty will grow. From the darkest depths, life and joy will find a way. I'm not even joking, that fucked me up. That fucked me up. Uh, okay. I should probably go home um, because uh, just had a little moment where I saw myself and what I'm doing. I am under the bleachers, um, crying about moss. I kind of want to kiss the moss. Is that stupid? Is it a fungus? Is it gonna make me sick? I wanna kiss it, it's so sweet. Just you and me, girl. Are you ready? What does my life become? I don't know, bitch, but it feels right. I love you. All right, so my life has brought me to this moment. It has, standing under the bleachers at a baseball field in the rain falling in love and smooching some moss while screaming to myself. Do I feel a little weird? Yeah, yeah. Have I lost my mind? There's a 50% chance. There's a 50% chance. Does it feel more right than anything else? Has I ever felt before? That's 